everybody, Aaron Zamzo, FireRescueFitness.com. My goal is to help EMTs, firefighters, and paramedics stay and get more fit for duty. One of the things that is a barrier to staying fit, staying lean, is nutrition. And on our Fire Rescue Fitness Facebook page, one of the top barriers or questions that I get is how can I eat more healthy when I'm on the go, when I'm on shift, um, you know, when I'm really, really busy, I'm getting a lot of calls. So uh, today I came up with five, actually six nutrition hacks for you to use in the firehouse, in your own house, um, that's gonna help you stay on track with your nutrition. Now the first thing that I do personally and, and what I feel is one of the most important is if it's out of sight, it's out of mind. So when you go to the firehouse, when you go to your home, if you have sugary donuts and candy and things that tempt you, get them out of your sight line at least. So like in the firehouse, there always seems to be something on the kitchen table. When I start my shift, don't tell my crew this, but I take it and I put it up in the cupboard because inherently we're all lazy. If it's in front of us, we're gonna eat it. If it's not, and you have to go to the cupboard to eat it, you're less likely to be tempted. And then what I also will do is I'll throw some healthy stuff out, like some uh, celery or um, you know some vegetables. I'll put those on the table or fruit instead. So first thing, out of sight, out of mind. Keep frozen is number two. And what I mean by that is when you go to the store, stay to the outside. Most of the healthy food is on the outside of the store. And um, you know, the, your fruits and your vegetables, um, your healthy dairy, your healthy meats are all around the outside. So try to stay to the outside when you go shopping. Third is use rotisserie chickens. Um, a lot of times uh, supermarkets will already have them cooked. Uh, what I've been doing and what I really like and what was really the purpose behind this post was I, I bought an air fryer, a healthy air fryer from um, Amazon and I use it constantly. So I'll buy chicken or I've even done steak and um, just season it. You don't need any oils when you use these air fryers. They're very, very quick and efficient. They heat up fast. So a lot of times when you're hungry, that's usually when you're more tempted to eat something bad. This it takes like, you know, as little as 15 to 20 minutes, you'll have nice chicken breast uh, or nice steak. So here I just threw some seasoning on it. You throw it in. Um, you can also then use some frozen vegetables. So you throw these in for five, two chicken breasts in for about 12, and in about 15 minutes, you're ready to go with a nice, healthy meal. And then the other thing is that use Tupperware to, um, to ha always have some of these prepared. But this healthy fryer has really helped me. I hope it helps you. So that's the, the third. The fourth is try to always have three or four recipes that only take about 30 minutes. And a, and a quick and easy way to do that is you, um, you have a protein, you have a, a whole grain, and then you get a vegetable source or a salad. There's pre-mixed salads or pre-washed salads. You, that's really good. You can use the air fryer to throw some chicken on there. Um, and then you can have a, a good whole grain, so brown rice or quinoa. Um, and just things that you can throw together in 30 minutes or less. Potatoes, sometimes you can throw them. They have some steamable bags with the chicken breast and your salad. So try to have some go-to quick, easy, healthy meals. Um, and then the other thing is um, have some healthy snacks. I actually did a post on 10 of the top snacks um, for firefighters uh, that they can use in the firehouse. That's linked to the blog post with this video. But always try to have almonds, um, some fruits. I like to use these kind bars. Um, look though, when you are looking at snacks, look for the lower sugar options. So um, try to always be prepared if you can't really, if you, if you really are in a pinch, um, I put these in the, in, the, um, in the truck with me. But the biggest thing is be prepared with your nutrition. Uh, use these hacks to then make sure that when you are tempted, you have go-tos, healthy go-tos. And finally, uh, last but not least, this is a bonus one, drink water. Always have water available, whether it's um, on the truck, in the car, at the firehouse. Uh, the more hydrated you are, the less likely you are to crave bad things. A lot of times, uh, dehydration and thirst has been mistaken for hunger. So stay hydrated. I hope these five, actually six different hacks, as I like to call them, help you out. There is a link, uh, whether you're watching this on Facebook or watching this on YouTube, there's a link below to the actual blog post uh, that also has some other links to some healthy snack ideas. 
and uh, everything else. So please uh, let me know if this helped, how else I can help you. Uh, and ultimately what I'm trying to do is get you fit for duty.